Lauren. I am live on Facebook with that Nest Cam, so can you make sure that it can see what's happening? Can you guys hear me? I asked Lauren to move the camera so that it can see. They didn't know I was trying to film this live from that camera. So what they're doing is trying to look at her eyes without sedating her at 21 years old and the fact that she may have had a seizure or a stroke. We really don't want to sedate her if we don't have to because it's so dangerous. So they put drops in her eyes so it would dilate and now they're trying to look at it with the light but they have to squeeze her and she's not happy about that. Yeah, she's 21 years old, so multiply by six, and that's about how old they'd be if they were a human. Well, I feel like, at least the right eye, I got a fairly good look. Okay. And all that looks normal. Okay. I think uh, left eye, I can get similar hairy papillary, like our The guy who's talking is another ophthalmologist from Dr. Miller's office. I don't know if Dr. Miller's here, if it's just him. Susan. Sorry about this angle. Apparently they're either not getting my text or they can't get around there because of the, it's so narrow in there with those cages in the side. Okay, so they're going to go next door, and Clover is in the Windsong Memorial Hospital. I wonder if I can switch over there.
well it doesn't look like they came over there so they're asking me to come up and meet them and I will go do that and I'll still try to get you guys live in a few minutes on this camera over here. Bye!